Hey guys, what's up? It is your friendly neighborhood. Ubers here, back again with another Binding of Isaac Afterbirth video. We're doing the daily run. It's Isaac, apparently. Let's go. Let's do it. Uh, okay, this is weird. So we're Isaac, but we're starting with piercing shots. Oh, it's because it's Thanksgiving. Alright, so <laughs> we're apparently an Indian. Uh, we have to be Mega Satan, who's probably the white people. Uh, and let's go. This is a hand-picked daily run, uh, as it is a holiday. This is, this is not a trap, okay. Shocking, actually. I wholeheartedly expected a tinted rock in the very first room off of the, off of the start to, uh, almost certainly always be a gold chest. Turns out that's not the case. Also, this is normal mode, so all champions will drop their full consumables, which is cool. Explosive diarrhea. Okay. There's just die spiders. <laughs> just fucking die. All right. So there's a chance that there's no item rooms. Um, I'll have to finish exploring the floor, of course, to verify that. Uh. Because I don't know. Maybe there are. Maybe there aren't. I feel like there probably aren't. Because um, that sounds like a thing Edmund would do. But, hey, look, there it is. Never mind. Hey, it's shit. Hey, it's not as shit, but probably also shouldn't have wasted my reroll there. We'll find out what we got in the boss room. It's probably not going to be nearly as good, but... Nearly as good as Kane's other eye? Yeah, okay. Well, listen. I didn't quite think about what I was saying. Literally nothing can be as bad as Kane's other eye. So, by default, our boss room item is going to be good. Well, better than Kane's other eye. Alright. So the Widow's not bad at all. Is this literally it though? Like, are we are we literally just we we just we just a Native American? Is that it? That's all the seed is. Nothing nothing fancy. Just we we look like an engine. That's it. I guess so. Hey, look a vanilla HP up. Hey, look a vanilla HP up. All right, moving on. I have a lot of health. I I would like. To get a deal with the devil on this floor, obviously. That'd be numero uno on my to do list. I do honestly like piercing shots, though. Um, there was actually a run. I don't have a key. There was a run fairly recently. Uh, I think it was actually literally yesterday's daily. Um, where I actually re rolled. Sagittarius and you know I, I wasn't really thinking about it at the time but also I think it was an alright play I think it was okay there's a lot of eternal hearts I think it was an okay play Ex explicitly because like damn man you can get better than Sagittarius you know it's not that it's a bad item it's just that there's there's always better and sometimes you get greedy. I do really like the piercing shot effect, though. It's very good. Very, very helpful in a an incredibly large amount of situations. One makes you smaller. All right, let's clear up, clear up these little duders, these little mulligans. Hopefully, there we go. All right, now we can fight Monstro. So obviously, I'm just looking for damage. I'm looking for maybe brimstone. I'm looking for a full guppy in one deal with the devil. I'm looking for anything that isn't just triple red chest, triple troll bomb. That's pretty much the only thing I really want to avoid. Uh, or you know, comparable things such as triple red chest, but all of them have spiders. But eh, whatever, man probably not gonna happen probably not gonna go well never does let's find out that is 
Oh, it's because it's a turkey. All right. <laughs> All right. I understand now. I get your jokes, Edmund. I get your jokes. Um, I'm scared to re-roll it because I feel like it'll re-roll back into the exact same thing. Uh, but apparently every boss is just going to drop turkey. Which is fine. We can make that work. It's weird, but we can make it work. That's it. Alright, well, uh, okay. Let's hope, then. Thank God. Um, alright. So, yeah, I'll just I'll bomb right here. Mm -hmm. That was a waste. Oh, well. I wasn't really feeling uh, Celtic Cross. It's not really... I don't know. It's not a very active item. I haven't been hit a single time yet. Um, so it wouldn't have been of any use to me so far. Which is, I think, pretty good grounds for re-rolling. If two floors deep an item has literally zero benefit to me, then what are the chances it'll have benefit to me later in the run? I mean, pretty high. Let's, okay, let me clear that up. Hang on. <laughs> it's pretty high. I'm gonna get hit, but... I also hate items that require you to get hit. And Celtic Cross is probably one of the best ones, one of the best items that you can get that does require you to get hit for it to have any effect at all. It is honestly probably one of the best. That doesn't make it good. It's just one of the best. Finally got a key. That's nice. Am I really just that good at being hit by garbage I've already dodged? Holy crap, dude. I keep doing it. <laughs> I, I have a problem. Either that or it's just an incredible skill. A very specific set of skills. Alright. No! So, th the golden remote, uh, in case you're wondering, it actually, what it does, uh, because I was mistaken in a previous run, what it does, ooh, nice, is it puts you into an undiscovered room. Right? It, it brings you to a room that you have yet to discover uh, on the floor. Which means that um, you can use it after you fully explore the, the floor to guarantee that you find the secret room and such. Um, and it's, I mean, it's pretty cool. It's a cool item. Uh, obviously, it's far more abusable if you have uh, an excess of batteries lying around. Because then you can essentially force the I am error room after you actually fully explore the floor. Um, this sucks, buds. Oh, come on, man. Did he only do a half heart? What? He actually only... No. Wait, did he? No, he did a full heart, right? Yeah, because I only... Yeah, 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 okay, he did a full heart. Never mind, never mind, never mind. Never mind, never mind, never mind, never mind. I'm just imagining things. Fucking Globins, though, doing their full hearts of damage even on the fucking caves. Globins! <laughs> Alright. Curse room or not, uh, I'm just gonna say nah. That's fine. I don't need to go into there. Uh, I will, of course, blow this up, though. Thank you. You know what? I'm gonna check this out. This might seem like a gigantic waste of keys, and it it probably is. Turns out, wasn't a gigantic waste of keys. I should go to the shop, actually. Let's go to the shop. Let's backtrack a million times through that snaky walkway room. That sounds like the plan. I mean, it seems fine to me. It seems like a pretty reasonable plan. Uh, you know what? Screw it. I am gonna go to the curse room on the way back. I am gonna do that. Placebo. There's a battery, though. Let's take the battery and the spirit heart and the key, and we're good. Taking the spirit heart to essentially, you know, make it five cents to enter my curse room rather than uh, a full heart. That's fine. 
not the best. I am going to go to the boss first, and then I will, if I don't need to re-roll anything over there, then I will come back and re-roll my uh, treasure, my uh, item room. That's what it's called. Not a treasure room. You dummy. So this is why piercing shots is really good, because uh, enemies that spawn other enemies actually just become super easy to deal with. Normally you have to kind of mix and match how you're going to manage the boss plus the, the the dudes that they spawn. Okay, uh, that's fine and dandy. <coughs> I will like, I would like to re-roll my item room. That was like halfway between Russian and Christopher Walken. That was very bizarre. Sure. Mystery sack is just fine. Okay. So maybe I should have taken placebo. Placebo can make very for very broken runs. You do absolutely 100% of the time need a 48 hour energy pill though. Um, which is what makes it kind of, I don't know. It's, it's very, it's very specific. If you've already discovered a 48 hour energy pill, uh, in, in your pill rotation, I can imagine taking placebo, uh, a lot more often. But, if you're like me, and have yet to discover it, um, don't even know if it's there, then yeah, it's a bit more questionable to take placebo. Like, it can be useful, but... I think, I think it's unlike Blank Card in that you actually really have to know what your pills are first. With Blank Card you have the benefit of being able to actually see what the tarot cards that you're, you're copying are before you actually use them. So you can actually, you know, even on the first time use of a tarot card, you get to, um, you get to abuse it with Blank Card, right? That'll do. Yeah, that'll do. Okay. <laughs> I'm cool with that. Thirty seven cents. It's pretty pretty good amount. I hate this room, by the way. It's very finicky. If you have low range, this room is actually just impossible. I mean, not actually, literally impossible. You can always just wait until the room ends. Yeah, let's get tiny. Uh, no. God, no. No. Yes. <laughs> Absolutely yes. This is one of my favorite items ever. And also we have piercing shots, which makes it so much better. Incredible. Monster's Lung is the kitty's titties, if you will. Alright, well, that's some money, huh? I love Monster's Lung so much. Monster's Lung is kind of like a poor man's... Uh, piercing shots in a lot of situations where you're kind of like you, you're oh fuck you're trying to hit an enemy who's behind another enemy and then you just blast through the front one right but with piercing shots it's just even better man it's like actually insanely good give me that damn it also, being able to one-burst enemies is really nice. Uh, pardon me. Yeah, that was totally bullshit, and you know it. Fucking knock it off, enemies. Holy crap, man. Slippery nickel, ah! Oh. The worst thing is, I don't actually understand the slippery nickels. They make no sense to me. Like, they just seem to exist, I guess. I don't know, man. <laughs> They're fucking weird. Oh, come on. There we go. 
So lots of money is really, really nice, obviously. Um, there's a lot of reasons why a lot of money is nice for, you know, most most people just have a, a, a myriad of reasons, but I think the number one reason that I like having a lot of money is because it leaves money equals power as a live pickup. Also, Midas Touch damage does scale with the amount of money you have, and I do have Midas Touch. Alright, so Gertie sucks, um, just because of the, the tediousness. Thankfully, wasn't too bad. Hey, look, more turkey. Tempted to reroll just to find out, um, if I can get anything other than turkey. Let's do it. Nope. Only turkey. It's Thanksgiving. Give me turkey! I want turkey! Why is my... Okay, my brain just, like, fucked up there. I don't know what's going on, man. <laughs> that was weird. I, like, I was... I, I took, like, a step back. And, like, the room just didn't make sense to me for some reason. That was very bizarre. I mean, I, I'm good now. That was just a weird, like, one-off moment where it just stopped. My brain stopped working, basically. <laughs> it's not good. Should probably get that checked. Have you ever just been there and been like, yo, my brain doesn't work? <laughs> yeah, same. It sucks, huh? Okay, pardon me, Mr. Spider. Apparently you're broken, which is nice. But, yeah, stop that. Okay. No, charge time, please. Okay. Charge time! Bow -wow. By the way, uh, you probably have already noticed, there's no stream today. Uh, sorry about that. Uh, it's Thanksgiving. <laughs> so, yeah, sorry. No, no stream today. I should have said it in the video that went up this morning, but I forgot while I was recording. So, here's your late mention of... Well, late have an acknowledgement that there wasn't a stream today, and I apologize. It's honestly probably for the better, though. Um, because Hearthstone's a pretty brutalizing game. Makes you, makes you upset. Makes me upset. Taking a break from that's pretty good. Also, I should probably just stream not Hearthstone at some point. But Hearthstone's actually fun. For no matter how much I say it's brutal and I hate it, um, and it's like my least favorite game that exists, it's also like my favorite game that exists. I don't know, not my favorite, but it it scratches my card game itch in a good way. Mine. It definitely it scratches an itch that I certainly find uh, in need of scratching. I've gotten, what, two or three lockups so far from picking those thingamadoohickies up. Uh, I could reroll this. I think I will. That's probably good. Probably worthwhile. Uh, yeah, none of this matters. More options is almost certainly going to be useful. Now, am I going to get another reroll? That is the question. I feel like probably yes. Uh, I feel like there's a high chance of it. Looks, looks good. I mean, it looks like I'm going to get a reroll. We'll see, though. I mean, this room will put me to three charge out of six, right? So, as long as the room to the left is actually a room, then... I'll get a reroll. Let's find out. Crystal ball. Well, that didn't help me. Kinda helped. 
this will this will put me to four, and then I can go to the. Uh... Okay, cool. So it is it is a real room. It's a a real room that's very, very fucking weird. I don't know if there was a way to get through that without just being lucky. Uh, but all right, that's cool, man. It's cool, bruh. It's all right, bruh. Kind of expected this. Uh, I guess this means I don't have to fight in my... Dang, another lockup. In my, uh, this room over here. But I'm gonna check what's in it first. And if it's something good, yeah, I'll fight for it. Alright, it's pretty good. Dang it. There we go. No! Stop! Oh my god, the charge time. Stop! Stop leaving. Stop. Stop it. There we go. So, in case you're unaware, I'm clearly not going to make it to the boss rush. Probably not hush either. I'm sorry. Hey, and a battery dropped. That's neat. Oh my god! Woo! 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 Alright, well I'm gonna do the smart thing and first go to our boss. Because this is still, yeah, Necropolis 1. Which means that I can definitely go to my boss and everything will be great. And we can hope and pray. You know what, let's actually take this with us. I'm not gonna leave the floor without Jera, but I will... Yeah. Okay, um, certainly that was a good play. Because <laughs> fuck this boss. In particular. Alright, turns out the item that I kind of expected to do nothing does nothing. Weird. It's weird. Well, I get to... Oh, alright. Uh, yeah, let's reroll. That's pretty good. Give me that, give me that. Uh, I don't really need that thing. And of course I will take my turkey. My disgusting, moldy, rotten-ass turkey. Oops, let's just go, man. Of course I will be rerolling this a bunch. You know what, that's pretty good. Let's reroll our item room. Common cold is pretty good. I should almost always get a common cold shot. Um in every burst. In fact, I'm almost- I, I think I might be guaranteed to get a common cold shot in every burst. Just based on my luck stat alone. Alright. It sucks, I'm not even taking it. Which is sad, honestly, but you know what? It sucks. So nah, mate. That's sad, too. I mean, I could have gotten something sweet, like, I don't know, Cricket's Body or something. That would have been awesome, huh? Or Parasite. I hate these Leapers with a uh, charge shot, because... They just always leap right when your charge is up. Without fail. That's what they do, man. It sucks. I hate it. I wish it would stop. That is perfect, though. Steven is beautiful. So beautiful. One more deuter. Cool. All right, I'm gonna pick this up and I'm gonna put it down and you're gonna stop showing up, all right? You're gonna stop. Petrify poop, this is the third time I've seen you. I don't need more. I really never did need more. And you just kept coming, man. You just kept on coming. Damn it. So do I take 
that. Probably not, right? That eternal heart is probably not very worthwhile. There is a tinted rock that I should probably uh, sort out. God damn it. Why are you such a bitch? Alright, cool. Alright. I'm really hoping for a small rock at some point. I have blown up every tinted rock that exists. I think. Pretty sure. And I've yet to find a small rock. Which is not my idea of a, of a good situation. But it's alright. I mean, it's not it's not the end of the world that I don't get small rock. But I don't really have a use for all the spirit hearts, <laughs> which is why I'm, I want small rock so bad. Got him. Alright, so there cannot be greed in our shop. Oh, come on. The hosts... So I just need to find my shop. I mean, that's the boss, and that's that's good info. But I do need to find my shop. And my item room. I have no idea where they are. And I have no idea where I've been. Alright, I think I've, I've figured it out. I think I know where I'm going. Alright, this way. That was a new room. Uh, let's, let's pop this bad boy open. Not worth it, to be honest. Not worth it for two keys, but... Alright, let's go to the right. I feel good about the right. Oh, come on. Blah. Dang it. <laughs> They're just not clumped at all. Take, like, two bursts per dude is basically the rate I'm going right now. Which is not good. Is this seriously? Ugh. Alright. Here. Ugh. What is this clusterfuck? Oh my god. Alright. At least I can do something with spirit hearts now. I see forever. Sure. Demon Baby is perfectly fine. Not a great item, but honestly, uh, not a bad one. Although he doesn't count towards, um, conjoined, so maybe, maybe he's not so great, huh? I'm not going for speed this run, as you can probably tell. Monstro. Easy peasy. Okay. I do need to find my special rooms. I could have sworn I've been here. I have. So what direction is there left to go? Pardon me? In this room, down I've been. Left I've been. Like, where do I go, actually? Hang on. No, wait. Wait. <laughs> Have I not explored the entire floor and there isn't a shop nor item room? I feel like I've explored the entire floor. Unless this isn't as dead end as I think it is. It's pretty dead end ish, huh? Yeah, no, that's a dead end, certainly. Okay, so I've been right off of the off of the start. I've been up off of the start. Right, okay. Correct. Let's see if I can go left from here. No, but I can go down. Which puts me in this double key room, which is pretty good. Uh, alright. It's pretty good. Right, and then I've... Uh, this is this is now left off of the start, and down off of the start. Right, so let's just... Let's go straight left, all the way left. Oh, this is where I... I think I didn't go left here. Yeah. And they're both right there, too. <laughs> the one direction I've yet to go is where it all is, man. You know what? That's pretty good. I like Mini Mush. 
Mini Mush is a tier height up with a range down attached. Which doesn't sound good, but it is actually good. Hey look, the stopwatch. What a what a good item, huh? Yeah, I should take that, huh? What a shitty shop, huh? Fuck, man. Like, I could re-roll it, I guess. I have a lot of... Well, I don't know if I have a lot of batteries. Let's take it. Mom's key is good. I actually don't remember where the batteries are, and I'm not... I'm not willing to check. I'm just gonna leave. I don't need batteries, man. I should. There were batteries, right? Or was that only the last floor? I could have sworn... I had at least one battery aside from the one that was inside the spikes. Let's find out, huh? Not here. Was it was it over this way? Probably not. Uh was it in there actually? Shit, I don't remember. I don't think so. You know, I'll just step on spikes. There's spirit hearts all over the fucking place. Why not? Why not just step on spikes and grab a battery, you dummy? See, there's a spirit heart right there. What? What? Alright, I've discovered something incredible. Turns out that because you can... I, uh, uh, Alright, well, it's alright, guys. It's okay. I figured it out. I've solved the mystery. Something something would have gotten away with it too if it weren't for those meddling kids and that stupid dog. Something like that, right? You know what? I could min max or I could just fucking blow it up. <laughs> The Joker. Oh, shit. I mean, yeah. Huh? It's pretty good. Alright. So that's a guppy item. And now this is where I backtrack, of course. And I do actually grab this and that. Backtrack more. <laughs> we're, we're being very methodical here. Very, very methodical. Gotta be. There were batteries. Littered all over the place. I should have known. I actually, like, actually should have known. <laughs> that was dumb of me. Alright, that'll be enough. I, I, I mean, I'm, I'm sure there's more. I don't remember where they are. And I'm, I just, I've spent enough time on this floor. So let's go. Isaac. Holy, oh my god. Oh, right, Midas Touch is really good, huh? Apparently this is Dark Room. Ugh. Ugh. I should have known. Every time that we go to Mega Satan, it, it, it's always Dark Room, man. I think that's actually true. I think it's every single time we've we've gone to Mega Satan, it has been dark room. Well, thank God I have flies. Otherwise, that just wouldn't have even worked out at all. The Bible, Satanic Bible. Let's get a black heart. Why not? Give it a re-roll, a Rooney, Book of Revelations, Anarchist Cookbook. All right. I'm not digging how the the one-eyed globins are not getting actually one shot. They're just getting like first form one shot. That's pretty good. That might have been a bit of a waste actually, but you know what? Book of Belial. Book of Shadows. There's like what two more rerolls until we're out of the out of the library. I don't know, I haven't really been paying attention to how many books I've seen. I'm just gonna give a, a rough low estimate for how many more rerolls. And then if I'm even remotely close to accurate, then, uh, you know, you can praise me at that point, I suppose. 
All right, so I am gonna get a reroll ready um, for the boss. This is a weird room. I've never have I actually seen that? No, maybe I have. It's a new to Afterbirth one. I think I have seen it before. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, I think so. Also, I definitely should have used Book of Revelations on this floor. I should have popped it once, even though it wouldn't have given me anything. Um, I don't actually know which one of those is the horse. Probably the left. Because that's the one I don't want. Whichever one is the horse is the one I don't want. Go to the pit. That's pretty good. Let's just pop the world. Alright, let's take the right one. Yep. Another health up is pretty cool. It's pretty rad, you know? It's pretty swell. Pretty sweet. Pretty cool. Now to jump. Book us in. Shit. Telepathy for dummies. Book of secrets. There we go, Ares. Dead bird. Those both suck, but <laughs> it's alright. Don't really need more of this floor. I think we're Gucci. Let's go. See, that would be a great situation to not have Curse of the Blind. But unfortunately, uh, I'm not so lucky. Pretty much ever. It's alright, though. It's okay. Everything is fine. Now I just gotta fight through, like, three more floors. Well, technically I don't actually have to fight through the dark room. All I have to do is, you know, end it. Fight Mega Satan. But that doesn't sound like fun, huh? When I put it that way? Doesn't sound like fun. Alright, so we do have uh, one more deal with the devil, if it pops up, which I don't think is an unreasonable expectation. I also have 99 goddamn cents. <laughs> That's insanity. So many coin drops throughout this run. Like, yeah, some of it is, is the way I played, right? But, like, there's no denying that there's been a lot of coin drops in this run. I absolutely have, like, in the in the early game of the run, I was playing to get as many coins as possible. But since then, I've gotten immense amount of coins without actually trying to. I hate this room. It's alright. Uh, sure. I don't need keys for anything, ever, so. And I don't need coins, but they can give me lockups, maybe. They didn't. The dream is dead. Dream is f fucking dead. It's okay though. See, that was a bit aggressive of a way to finish that room, <laughs> but it, was, it worked out. As I was doing it, I was like, "This is a really dumb idea. I'm gonna get hit." Didn't though. That's good. That's good. I can imagine. Okay, listen. Mystery sack. I understand that you're having a laugh. I'm not, though. Alright. I ain't having that shit. You feel me? Bros of... This, this fight's obnoxious uh, at the moment, because that nub all the way across the map is just not going to die. I can, like, go chase him down, but that would just put me in a weird spot. And with a high potential of just fucking killing myself. <laughs> or at least damaging myself, kind of pointlessly. Alright, cool. So we did get a deal. Ooh. Ooh. 
Ooh, yeah, re-roll it. Re okay, please, shoot, there we go. Re-roll it. Dang it, I was hoping for Guppy. I was hoping real bad for Guppy. It's all right, though. I got Leviathan, apparently. Didn't really think about that at all. Apparently, Spirit of the Night does count towards Leviathan, then. Interesting. So that would mean Lord of the Pit doesn't, then? I guess? Shit, man, I don't know what counts and doesn't count. Leviathan, Leviathan is pretty sweet, though. So, I definitely had a time where I had packed Lord of the Pit and Leviathan, er, and, uh, and Spirit of the Night, and I didn't transform into Leviathan. And I do know the pact counts towards Leviathan, and now I know that Spirit of the Night counts towards Leviathan. So I guess that means Lord of the Pit doesn't count towards Leviathan? Which is weird, because people have said that it does. I guess I shouldn't trust these ethereal people. This, this non-existent people that I'm referring to. Who is people? See, that's the first time you've given me a trinket. Well, you gave me Swallowed Penny, and then you gave me Petrified Poop for... Ooh, how many floors? All of them? Literally always. All I, all I had was Petrified Poop. See, that's not what I wanted. But at the very least, we are near the boss. That was a good timing, huh? Cool. Hey, you gonna you gonna stop that? Get slam jammed. Grab that shit, dark bum. No, grab this shit, dark bum. There you go. I was kicking it around. I was like, hey, Dark Bum, you want this? And he's like, yes! Nah, uh, uh, uh. Not today, Dark Bum. Not today. And then I let, it have, let him have it. I was feeling bad, you know? It's not there. The Super Ziggy room's not there. Maybe it's because it, that would be adjacent to two rooms. So it's not physically possible. I would know that if I walked one room to the side. It doesn't matter, though. Oh, shit. Which one's better? Probably Jera. Not really. Uh, yeah, I mean, probably not. I think 48 hour energy is almost explicitly better. Because the thing is, right? There's only one situation where Jera's better. And that is where, like, some amount of these are item chests and. Uh, I actually want the very first item. Oh, shit. It's not Guppy, though. It's garbage. I want my money back. Turns out none of them were... ...items. Alright, let's go. Steve, go! Hopefully I can beat him. I feel like I'm I'm in, I'm powerful enough to beat him. I feel like I should have known that was coming. Okay, so that's his tell. See, here's the weird thing. That's the first time I've ever actually seen the tell. Well, it's the first the first pair of times I've ever been hit by that attack. All right. So I didn't know what I was looking for. I hate this. <laughs> this is actually such a nightmare. I might actually, like, be incapable of beating Mega Satan with this low damage. Maybe I should have taken the stopwatch, man. Stopwatch is broken, you know? Never seen this. What are you doing, Mega? What you doing, bucko? Come on, man.
There we go. I figured it out. I realized what his tell was and I avoided it. Avoided the hit. Kind of. I mean, I, like... I don't know, man. <laughs> this is a weird fight. <laughs> oh god, what happened? <coughs> Sorry. Holy crap. I almost died. That wouldn't have been a good way to fight Mega Satan at all. Death doesn't help. <clears throat> I don't like you. Any of you. I really don't like this. Stop. Greed? Greed. Greed. You're shooting the wrong direction, Brosif. That's the problem I have with Super Greed. He always shoots not towards me, right? Like, he shoots, like, the, okay, let's say I'm down and left of him, like that, right? I was down and left of him. But I'm far more down than I am left. And then he shoots left. That's what screws me up. Come on, man. How did the other one die so easy and you take so long? See, that's not a brimstone shot, but it was the exact same tell. Alright, here's hoping that I can actually beat this part. It's much more bullet hell than the first part. means it's it's hard <laughs> I'm bad at bullet hells man which is weird because I play Isaac I don't like this attack either they're like dancing I don't know man yeah yeah this is just garbage <laughs> like I've said before uh, garbanzo beans. Definitely garbanzo beans. Fuck. Alright, get in. Use those iframes. Use and abuse them. Dude, how screwed would I be if I didn't take the, the one makes you smaller multiple times? Pretty screwed, right? Also, this is fucking with my eyeballs. That was very weird looking. There we go, we did it. It wasn't pretty. It wasn't clean. But it happened. I beat it. 6d9 oath. <laughs> that's, I mean, that's pretty good. 690. Time is 555th. That can't be possible, but that's okay. That's an alright score. I'm pretty happy with that score. Let's find out how many cheaters there are. A lot. There's a lot of cheaters, as usual. Uh, well, thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, please be sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe, do all that good shit, and I'll see you guys back again later tomorrow uh, with another run. And maybe I'll be streaming tomorrow? I don't know. We'll see. Probably. It's not Thanksgiving, so yeah, probably. Bye!